Uh, we got a 56 Cadillac here that we're uh, in the blasting stages now. We've got the car completely stripped apart all the way down. You can see we put it on a jig, loaded it on the trailer where we can take it back here and start soda blasting now. That's the first stage we do. Here, you can see this is the beginning of what it looked like when it came in here. Thank God it's only got about one coat of paint on it. We know there's a lot, not a lot of Bondo underneath it because it hasn't been painted two or three times, which is amazing for a car this old. But you can see where he's already started on the firewall here. It'll get all this paint off, all the original material, but it doesn't do a very good job of getting the rust out. So we're gonna have to come back and spot blast all this with sand once we're done. But you can see what kind of shape the metal's in. You really start getting an idea of what kind of shape the car is in at this point here. And so far, amazingly, as old as this car is, sat in a barn 25 years, it structurally looks really nice. You can see some stuff down here, real common places, the lower rocker panels are eating out. But and a little, you know, some minor damage here in the lower corners. But again, for a 1956, this car is in fantastic shape. This car was super well optioned. It had the rear AC package. It had the auto dim uh, high beams. Really nice car. This side here, you can see, he's already started coming down the side, blasting all this stuff off. Again, very good condition. This is a very nice car. A lot better than most of the ones we see in here. Same thing on this side, a little rocker damage, but easy stuff to replace. I wouldn't say easy, but not bad at all. Even the floor pans, he hasn't really started in here yet, but you can see they're pretty solid in this car. It's gonna come out nice. A few pit holes up in here and whatnot, you can see shining through the bottom here. But again, not too bad. This car is gonna be solid before Autorama. We're gonna have another video done of us acid washing this vehicle and then actually putting the etching primer and sealer on this car. We'll have it there in that shape. It won't be started into metal work yet, but we want to show the stages of how it comes along and what you want to see on a full restoration and this is how it should be done.